I'm running the New York City Marathon. So, in about 11 weeks time, I am running the New York City Marathon. And to do this, I had to get in shape. So, I hope you'll follow me along this journey. This is gonna be a tough one, especially since I'm starting at the 11 week mark. I did start last week. So let's look at the numbers real quick. On August 11th, Sunday, I did 3.32 miles in 55 minutes. I averaged about 16 minutes per mile. Not great. On Tuesday, I did 3.5 miles, 49 minutes. Averaged about 14 minutes per mile. And then on Thursday, I did 5.46 miles, which was the longest or still is technically speaking spoilers up ahead in one hour and 22 minutes with an average pace of 15 minutes per mile uh, we're gonna do this every monday a new video and yeah we got 11 weeks 11 weeks to get into marathon shape 26.2 miles the furthest i've been so far is five miles and uh that was like an hour and 20 minutes i think it was Boy, boy, that's the reason why I'm not doing that great today because my legs feel like jello still from two days ago or three days ago at this point. But that being said, um, a lot of people have asked me, why am I doing the marathon? Why did I sign up for it? Why did I volunteer my name? And I said, here are two things. One, I got to challenge myself. I want to be the best I could be. And for a long time, I focused on bodybuilding didn't really work out that great. I got big arms, but that's pretty much it. Uh, you know, my brother will tell me that my bench game is pretty good. Three plates. Three plates. to do a little different i gotta do a little more cardio because i want to i want to get a decent number i do want to impress people i do want to give people an opportunity to say if willie could do it i could do it because boy boy i'm not in the best shape of my life but if i could get there you could do that too so that's one reason the other reason it's probably the more important reason is because i'm running for make the road new york if you haven't heard who Make the Road is, here's a little montage. Some of the stuff that they have accomplished in their 25 years of being around. Racial equity and social justice can only be achieved when those most impacted lead the fight. That is why we are a membership organization and why our 25,000 members shape all of our campaigns. Through our organizing campaigns, we strive for a world that values the inherent dignity of everyone and an end to all forms of oppression. We envision a New York where all people have the support they need to live fulfilling lives. A place where students receive an education that brings out their best where there are plenty of good jobs, high quality affordable housing and accessible green space, where black and brown youth and trans community members can walk down the street without the fear of being stopped by the police simply because of who they are. Our work to create community schools, win victories in the workplace, preserve affordable housing, stop police abuse, decriminalize sex work and expand access to health care all builds towards this vision.
today's numbers are gonna be a little screw because right now I'm at like 17 minutes per mile and I can't run. My legs are shot because of the run I did. I also fell earlier today. I'll put the clip in. Um, I'm okay. At least I think I am. But I am tired. Uh, running on like six hours, not even five hours of sleep. And no energy. Uh, I'm also doing intermittent fasting at the moment. So my eating habits are very different as well. Um, it's, it definitely, definitely feels like it took a toll. It was a very long weekend. Over the weekend, my church had a event. And I was there from basically 9 o'clock in the morning all the way to 6 o'clock at night. Got home, tired, showered, got to bed, watched some UFC. I wanted to work out yesterday and I just couldn't because it was just too much going on. So, final numbers for the stats. 5.14 miles in an hour and 26 minutes. I couldn't run. I tried. I really did. Uh, my legs were shot still. Like I mentioned, it was a long day. Lots of stuff happened. 16, almost 17 minutes per the mile. Well, that's all I have for this episode. I'll be back here next Monday with another episode with a recap of everything I did for the week. Hope everyone does well. And of course, again, I ask everyone if you can support, great. Follow along on this journey on this channel or WGC Fitness. And um, the QR code for donation or any of the channels will be available shortly.